Friends, we have come rejoicing into the house of the Lord for this celebration, dear brothers and sisters. And now we stand with Alec and Jessica on the day that they intend to form a home of their own. For them, this is a moment of unique importance. So let us support them with our affection, with our friendship, and with our prayers as their brothers and sisters. For those of you who don't know, I've known Jess since we became roommates junior year of college. Very, very quickly, we became friends. We bonded over things. And before I knew it, we were friends and drinking buddies and so much more because a few months in, I remember stepping back and thinking, this girl that I just thought was gonna be my roommate has turned to being the person that I go to for everything. For advice, brutal honesty when you don't really wanna hear it, but you know you need to hear it. And just someone I know who will always be there for me no matter what. Obviously, first and foremost, I have to just tell you how much I love my daughter. And I probably don't say it enough, and I know I don't say it enough, and I don't say enough how proud I am of you, and how I admire you, and I admire you for how smart you are, your aggressiveness, your ambition. One of the things I admire about her the most is her, her sense of judgment, too. And I always have admired that about her at, at, from every step of her life. So I met Alec. And honestly, it confirmed my belief in her judgment of good character and being able to, to recognize just, just a spectacular person. I've known Alec since I was about 12 years old, and since then we've just grown closer and closer to the point where I now call Alec my best friend. I couldn't be happier that my best friend is going to be spending the rest of his life with this beautiful, intelligent, and warm-hearted woman that Jess is. It sounds cliche, but I can't believe we made it to today. Lots of people get cold feet before their wedding. I have not doubted our decision to get married even for a second. I have loved every minute of our journey, the laughs, the smiles, the tears, and even the fights because they are what make up us. I wouldn't change it for the world. The other day you asked me if I was starting to get nervous about the wedding and I told you that I didn't think I was. Well, that was not entirely true. I'm filled with excitement every time I think about our wedding day and I have no doubt that today is gonna be one of the best days of our lives. I'll never forget the snow day where we first met. I picked out the best looking guy in the room and asked for some drinks. We exchanged numbers and little did I know what I had started. Not only did I pick out the best looking guy in the room, but I picked out the kindest, funniest, sweetest, and most thoughtful. I picked the guy who is the hardest worker, best friend, and biggest supporter. The night you approached me will forever stand out clearly in my mind. You were wearing a black and white shirt, black pants, and brown boots. Funny enough, I also remember seeing you two weeks before in a white dress, way too nice for our house, <laughs> and thinking that I never stood a chance with a girl as beautiful as you. Today marks the start of our forever. I promise to love you every day, just as I do today. I can't wait to see what we build together. I love you more than you'll ever know, and I'm so happy that the next time I see you, I can call you my wife. You're the best thing that ever happened to me. I love you, Alec. Jessica received this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Alec received this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. And now it is my privilege and my pleasure to introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Alec and Jessica Krismer. <laughs>
can't wait to see what they do together because I think with their personalities and their aggressiveness and their kind-heartedness and, and all of the many wonderful personality traits they have, I am looking so forward to see what they do in life together. I would like to say congratulations to two of my absolute favorite people. I love you both so much. I'd ask you all to raise a glass and wish these two the longest and happiest marriage that we would know will happen. Cheers. I, Alec, take you, Jessica. I, Jessica, take you, Alec. To be my wife. To be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. To love you. And to honor you. All the days of my life. And the last thing that I really wanted to bring up, and, and this is probably inappropriate, but that's okay, because anybody who knows me knows that I, I do that kind of thing. But if there are counselors in here or marriage therapists, could I please get a card? Because you know, if anybody who's married, you run into problems <laughs> occasionally. And my true feeling is when you have Cubs, Blackhawks, Blues, Cardinals together, <laughs> they're gonna need it. Their kids will need it, Bandit will need it. And my hope is, is that your children root for another state.